Hey, sir. Zach, good to have you back. You should be at ease this episode because I'm at the table with you. I'm not at the little, the cooking eyes. You know, somebody mentioned that and, and I, I realized you always participate. Yeah, well this time I'm gonna be eating exactly what you eat. Yeah, but you always do that. Well, yeah, I mean, the problem, what should have you concerned is <laughs> I have no regard for what goes in this fucking mouth. <laughs> no, I know. Yeah, you're a garbage can. <laughs> this mouth has seen things that would make you shrivel up yeah. and die. <laughs> so first things first, wild burgundy snails. This is escargot. Motherfucker. <laughs> this is international cuisine. Wild I don't have snail. a puke bucket, by the way. You don't need one. Ooh, got a little handful of juice <laughs> there, snail juice. Uh, you know it's good when you're, you can't tell if they're mushrooms or snails. <laughs> that looks like a can of fucking shrooms, doesn't it? Oh, whew, the stench. <laughs> I can't wait to puke all over your table. <laughs> okay, I'll get you a goddamn puke bucket. <laughs> Jesus Christ. I'm dead. I'm fucking green already. <laughs> all right, I'm gonna, I'm gonna fork one out. I'm gonna be honest with you. I ate a big breakfast and then I had a protein shake. And uh, looking at these has me. Oh, go, go, come on, dude! <laughs> it's down your beard. We haven't even started yet. <laughs> I'm gonna be honest with you. My brother hates eating this horrible food, so I gotta pay him to do it. And in order to get the money to pay him, I got HelloFresh sponsoring this video. Now HelloFresh is a great service that sends you fresh ingredients, recipes to your house, so you can have fresh meals without having to use your brain or go outside or any of that hard stuff. And let me tell you something, dude, this stuff was still cold as can be after sitting on my porch in the Florida hellscape for a couple hours, you know? Uh, I had a blast cooking it with my wife. The food was delicious. The produce was fresh and girthy. HelloFresh offers meals of all kinds, vegetarian, pescatarian, fit, and wholesome meals. A little something for everyone, you know? And the foolproof step-by-step -step recipe cards are easy to follow along with. And I honestly, I've kept a couple that I've used for future usage. And the fact that I'm getting paid to eat this delicious spread just so I can then turn around and pay Zach to eat disgusting canned food. Well, that's just the icing on the cake. So, use my link or go to HelloFresh.com and use code POGSAMNOV70 for 70% off plus free shipping on your first box. Once you click, the description will live update and count up your purchases. Isn't that fancy? Anyways, let's get back to the torture. So, I, I forgot that we were doing this today and I promised my kid that I would take him to Waffle House. So, I just ate like a huge fucking breakfast. How do you do partial pukes? When I puke, it's the whole... Oh, no. The whole thing. You're just like, I just want to puke a, little, a thimble full. Yeah. Just a little, ah. Just a snail's worth. Yeah. This, I have to make room. Yeah. <laughs> My body must make room for the, dude, these reek. Can yeah, I open they, that fucking they, door? Yeah, yeah, dude. Like, Holy, whoo. Stinky, stinky God. snails. I didn't realize this stuff bothered you so bad. Let me cut this bad boy in half. Do you want to do a whole one or do you want to? Oh, the insides are not great to look at. I'm not gonna lie. I see like an intestinal tract or something in there. Was that heart? You wanna you wanna ha take that half, or do you wanna do a full one? <laughs> Cheers, my boy, my good sir. Ah, uh, French, beautiful culture. I'm amazed. It's like a sausage. It ain't like sausage. No, it's like a, it's very much like a sausage. Yeah, tastes like sausage. I swear to God, eat that fucking thing. Tell me that doesn't taste like sausage. Dude, I just watched All Quiet on the Western Front, right? <laughs> It's a World War I movie. Oh, yeah. 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 And, and I, I like look over at you and I'm just like, it tastes like sausage. And you got the thousand yard stare, dude. You're just like, 
you can pass it up for the next one if it, if that the next one is weird but not as uh visually uh yeah not as otherworldly as eating a bug off the floor you know like this is this is your lion moment from the lion king when he goes eats bugs in the woods with that pig and that little rat yeah thing. who can <laughs> yeah this is that moment why does it stink so bad probably has something to do with the fact that they're uh snails <laughs> they're uh, dirt things i don't know it has now come to that crucial moment where you shit or get off the pot. <laughs> and you've lost your opportunity. Stay uncultured, you bitch. <laughs> now that I got it freshed up with a little bit of that uh, snail juice. <laughs> Gotta have the other side too. Ooh. A little bit of a cartilage crunch there. I'm sure that's its eyeballs, <laughs> its eye stalks. I feel like I just ate Slurm McKenzie. You remember that from Futurama? That's, I'm tired of partying! <laughs> oh my god, I hope I didn't eat Slurm McKenzie. <laughs> Those little girls and everything, he's got his girls. <laughs> he brings the fucking house down. No, oh, it's like they left a piece of the shell in there. Ugh. Ugh. Can I get a drink? It'll cost you. <laughs> no, I got I got drinks for this occasion. I got little fucking wacky drinks to go with it. All right, All right I got a couple. We got a couple wacky sodas. Someone sent these into the P.O. box. We got ranch dressing soda, horchata soda, and butter soda. You have a. <laughs> By the way, also one of uh, one of the audience members sent this into the PO box. They made this. Yeah, check that out, dude. When you got some of that, uh, good job. Yeah, whoever made this, good. It's one of the nicer things in my kitchen. I, don't, I think these are twist top, but I'm still gonna <laughs> gonna use it. Yeah, they are. But. Yeah, this is ranch ranch dressing soda going down. You took a huge ass gulp of that. Ooh. Yeah. This will make me puke. Escargot will not make me puke. This might. That's not even ranch. Smell that. It smells like potpourri. What's this, uh, what's this cum bubble that's... Um... Oh, it's had... Uh, that's some of the ranch dressing has melted down to the bottom. Yeah, that's, that's wild smelling, right? That's, that's bad. <laughs> yeah, that that's... is... That's pretty bad. That, that is fucking, that is vile. Oh, no, if you twist it, you can see it's got viscousness to it. This is like a, this is a fucking bottle full of cum. It's like very cold cum. <laughs> oh my God. Saying that, I gotta take another swig. I'll try everything twice. Yeah, the way that sits on your tongue. I don't much care for that. <laughs> Next item on the menu. This is, uh, you know, in, in Russia, they have those cosmonauts. Yeah. It's like a much cooler name for an astronaut. Yeah. Well, they were like feeding them garbage. Like they actually have space food where they just squeeze it into their mouth. Yeah. And this is Texas burger, but in liquid form. Russian. Texas Russian. burger. Yep. I, I like they... the fact that I can't read what it is. Yeah. Well, that's because you're not a cosmonaut. Yeah. If you went to a fucking college. Yeah. You would know what the hell this says. This is in spaceman speak. Gotcha. You learned this at uh, the. Yeah, you did. Oh yeah, you yeah, gotta, you yeah, gotta you pop got, the you seal. Gotta... No wait, you don't have to. Well, I guess there's no cook. There's no open. Hold on, let me space. read. <laughs> oh, I'm not a spaceman. I have no fucking clue. Yeah. No, I'm sure they don't fire up the got... cast iron griddle up in space. Got, got a toothbrush. <laughs> <laughs> That's not a bad idea. Oh yeah. That's a good look. <laughs> Is there acid in that? Your uh, pupils got so huge. <laughs> this is the forkful went in in his eyes like, like a man that just thought he ingested arsenic. <laughs> couldn't, couldn't stomach it. <laughs> It says 1978 is, is, on the, is on the tube. 
You're telling me 1978 Texas burger is gonna be salty? Mmm. What if there's like a bun down in here? What if this is like the part we're not supposed to eat? What if they cap it? Uh, that, that's what I was wondering. Like, I wonder if once you get... Nah, once you get down into the meat of that, there's it's... No, there is no green pickle. It gets more wet. That's really... I don't, I'm tired of this so dry. We, we, we got the best part of it. Uh, yeah, I'm tired of this dry shit. I want some of that wet stuff out of middle. Ooh, and the stench is even crisper. Really? It's straight from the middle. Yeah. <laughs> every, every time you whip something and put something in your mouth, you open your eyes and it's like you're fighting inner demons. You're just like, this is a fucked up power dynamic. I'm written from this guy, he's my own brother. This is fucked my, up. <laughs> my health daddy. If, think, for think for the thousands of cosmonauts watching yeah, this, yeah. this is not a good representation of a Texas burger. I'm not gonna torture you with something too bad this time. This is an all around good one. And it's one I'm curious about, but more importantly, it's just kind of funny because it's also from SpongeBob. We got canned bread. How's this thing work? There we go. Oh, I did arms today. I'm pumped for this, I'm ready. It says gently push loaf. Oh, sorry, we gotta push out this loaf. That is a dense thing of bread. Is it? Yeah. A sandcastle, you know, you gotta, yeah. you gotta tap yeah, the sides. Yeah. You gotta tap the sides. It was the side tapping that really did it. Look at that, dude. Oh. Oh. <laughs> That's a dense boy. That's a dense boy right there. Even something simple as bread can taste disgusting out of a can. Oh, is it not good? It's like a meat bread. Like, why is, there, why is it so meaty? Here, I'm gonna make a slice. Are you gonna make a burger yeah, yeah, yeah. out of canned bread and... Texas burger? Burger. Yeah. I can't believe the shit you eat. It's moving on its own. <laughs> <laughs> this thing's alive. Are there weevils in there? Why did it rotate like that? <laughs> When I took a bite, it was like, something is consuming me. <laughs> true. That's true. And But what's weird is it's fat-free, yet it leaves an oil slick on the tongue. Yeah, it's... My mouth is coated. <laughs> All right, Zach, do you want to be disappointed or do you want to be pissed off? Which one do you want to be? This is one of the more disgusting things. We might have to get a bowl for this. This is a entire canned chicken, cooked, fully cooked. You just open this bad boy out, chicken slides out. <laughs> chicken does a little slippery slide right on out of there. Oh my God, where do you find these? From the kitchens of Sweet Sue? <laughs> Sweet Sue, baby, she's cooking up chicken. She does them rotisserie, throws them in the can. Sweet Sue looks like she's white as fuck. This probably ain't gonna yeah. taste too good. I Wait. feel like, by the way, if they got rid of uh, like Sweet Aunt Jemima soup? and stuff, oh yeah, because they were using her as like, you know, this bitch makes good flapjacks, right? You would think they would also get rid of Sweet Sue because you know that bitch don't make good chicken, <laughs> right? Yeah, you just see the face and you go like, I don't want her chicken, right? Just based off how she looks. She's wearing a fucking prairie hat, like she's going across the Oregon Trail. It doesn't have giblets though, are you okay with that? Oh. <laughs> Sweet Sue, you cracker bitch. <laughs> How do you make gravy without giblets? <laughs> you fucking honky bitch with your sun hat. No giblets? You inspected for wholesomeness by the US Department of Agriculture. <laughs> they don't inspect for anything else. They go, God damn it, Sue, that is a chicken in a can. <laughs> Don't know why you keep making this god awful product, but what the fuck else do you want me to say? As advertised. <laughs> As advertised, it's dog shit. Once again, Sue, you've outdone yourself. I want to know what else uh, the kitchen of Sweet Sue has. Ooh. Just save this for Thanksgiving. See the look on mom's face. Right? Oh. It's going to splash. <laughs> Wait. 
That, oh, <laughs> sweet Sue, that is falling off the bone. I, I was. Sweet Sue, are you sure this is cooked? <laughs> Fully cooked, it says, in, it says in the print right here, it says fully cooked Sweet Sue. Home style goodness. Sweet Sue, do you own a meat thermometer, you dumb bitch? Oh, you gotta get some of that. You gotta get some of that breast meat. There you go. A little bit of breast meat. Uh, let me get a good piece. Uh, I'm more of a dark meat guy myself. Oh, uh, are you? Yeah, I'm gonna get some mm. thigh. Mm. Oh, sweet Sue, the bone. It's coming off the bone. <laughs> we, holy shit. She makes it tender. You have to admit, she makes it tender. This will make any, uh, any Creole man smack his lips. Mm. That's not bad. No. No. Sweet Sue, we spoke too soon. You may look like Julia Roberts, but you can put together a goddamn good canned chicken. Goddamn. <laughs> uh, when you think about it, this is the most <laughs> industrial way of reducing an animal down to its base nutritional components. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> Sue, it's, it's so dry, I couldn't. <laughs> It's so dry, this is the wettest fucking chicken ever made. <laughs> this is the wettest chicken. It sure is a whole lot wetter than that steak I made you last time. Man, Sue. How do you do it? Seriously though, reduce this chicken to like a brine. <laughs> Oh my god. That's what I was gonna say. I've seen a dude get rid of his wife on forensic files the same way. Just put her in a 55 gallon th drum. That's all I kept thinking of. Yeah. <laughs> Fucking... I'm eating like a cartel murder. <laughs> oh. oh yeah, this fucking rocks. But the difference is, you know what the cartel skimps on? It's the butter and the salt. Yeah. This is really, Sue, your seasoning. Of course, <laughs> you're a white lady, so it's just salt and it's, butter. Yeah. You know, you could have done And there ain't enough of it. No, there's not <laughs> enough, of course, but, you know, uh, I'm sure if you're uh, out in Oklahoma <laughs> or, uh, you know, Missouri or something like that, this is probably one spicy chicken. This is yeah. probably pretty good. Yeah. Yeah. Well, Sue. That's some good fixing, Sue. Hey, Abby's going to have to compete with this for Thanksgiving. <laughs> Made with U.S. steel, too. She's a goddamn patriot. <laughs> God damn it, Sue! <laughs>
for the audience, uh, now that my brother's called into question your intellect and world knowledge, is I believe sheep and sheep stomach? It is sheep organs ground with uh, coarse ground oatmeal shoved into a uh, sheep stomach and then boiled. And then in this case... Well, in this case, it's, then, hi it's Highland beef minced up and put into sheep stomach and boiled. It should be, it should be good. It's premium quality. Look, on the back, it has, get this. What is that? Haggis, worthy of Robert Burns. <laughs> Robert Burns himself? <laughs> Who's that? Let's Google it. <laughs> He's a goddamn Scottish poet. From a magazine. You know what? In 2000. That's how they ship it to America. That shit's not legit. Is it not legit? No, because legit stuff has like lamb in it. Um, yeah, there's no like, sh where's the sheep? It's sitting Scottish haggis. We're getting North fucked. This is North Carolina haggis. Yeah. It's got this Caledonian kitchen has fucked us. Pop this you know in. what? Uh, I'd, I'd rather eat this than uh, the fucking snails. Really? Yeah. I thought the snails were charming. Oh, look at that. That's them some good eats right there. I'm going to go ahead and just take a little uh, off the top here. This seems to be the moistest bit. Oh, oh you're just going to do a little piece? All right, I'll follow, I'll follow the guests. Cheers. Yeah. Uh, fake Caledonian haggis. <laughs> your exhale after you put that in your mouth was like, have you ever heard like when a toddler is about to cry and they do like the, the weight? Oh, come on. Oh, I can't look while I'm chewing. Why is everything so fucking salty? Yeah, there's a lot of spices in this. What are you trying to cover up in this thing, you know? Yeah, man. This tastes like, uh, you know, when someone's serving you like bad meat and they're like, you add some more. <laughs> <laughs> uh, not the best culinary effort, guys. No. You can do better. I honestly think the great Robert Burns would not be happy with this. No. I guess he would be pretty upset. No. Yeah. We didn't realize there's a like a white dried cum glint to it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's part of the charm. <laughs> Look how moldy it looks. Honestly, this bread cuts like something that would taste awesome. You know? Yeah. It, it cuts. Yeah, it does. I, I, I was excited about the bread. Yeah, it cuts like, like I would imagine like a chocolate cake would cut, you know? Yeah. And then you get a bite and you say, that it ain't looks, no. It looks like grandma's old brownies. Yeah. And then, and then you bite into it and you say, this ain't grandma's old brownies at all. This is dog shit. This is the other grandma's brownies. <laughs> <laughs> this ain't grandma's brownies. This is grandma's brownies. Fuck. <laughs> okay, there we go. I got two good buns. Now we have to get some of the dry... Nice little thin serving of the dry haggis. That's coming apart nicely. Dude, and this is right after I got over the stomach flu. Like I, <laughs> these are dangerous eats. <laughs> these are, dude, that would be a good name for a show. Dangerous eats. That'd be like, uh, like the opposite of Alton Brown's good eats. Yeah. Dangerous eats. That, that is congealed fat, right? Yeah. Okay. Let me tell you something. Wrapping it in this bread ain't making it any better. The spices are getting all you up in there. absolutely <laughs> disgusting. And I, I think it is a fucking crime that somebody with as low of a standard of food like you has a wife that cooks so well. I always tell her, I said, hey, babe, dress it down a little bit, all right? <laughs> like... You're not gonna win any competitions in this house, okay? I'll eat whatever you put in front of me. No shit. <laughs> Wasted talent. Yeah. You want a bite? No. 